welcome to the video tutorial for the second submission for the qualifying challenge for the cognitive computing challenge. In this directory I have the documents to be converted both PDFs and zips along with the submission infrastructure processing.zip. I'm going to make a directory called uh, content and then I'll copy that copy the documents into that content and then Unzip that, and then I'll remove the zip file so that I only have zips and uh, PDFs and doc files. And then I'm going to extract the infrastructure processing, and then I have uh, sudo bash install uh, sorry infrastructure slash install dot sh, and that will install all the packages that we need to run this submitted entry. This is the same as our previous submission with the addition of the python dash dash docx library which allows us to extract the content from the docx files and load them into the Redis database. So everything else is very similar except with some additional content. So we're still using Redis, we're using the PDF libraries to extract the content So in this video, we won't cover the same thing that we covered in the, the first submission, which is like the query entry um, and all that stuff. It's pretty similar. So there's the Python docx library, and there's PDF miner, and we're done. So now we have uh, an infrastructure processing. We're gonna specify the location of the files in the config directory, so we have home then downloads content as the file as the folder rather so we'll copy that and gedit the con config file we'll paste that in so now we're going to save and close so that we can run the extraction. This is going to take all the pictures out of each of the PDFs and docx files and put them into a specific directory uh, listed here and then also the PDF will be there and then once PDF to text runs that's going to put a plain text file of the content and the last thing to run will be the PDF PO text. So we'll let this run for a few minutes and Come back when it's completed.
All right, so the PDF to text has finished. And then next we'll run the docx into Redis. And then the PDF to text. This will take a little bit of time. So the docx did not extract any plain text files. It loaded the content immediately into the Redis database. So if you look in the content extracted from documents directory, there is not a folder that corresponds to the docx file, but the content is in the Redis database. And we can see that with the, uh, the Redis browser tool. So while this is running, we'll just open that up. This will just verify that the content from the docx file is actually in the Redis database. So the name is just uh, CCC, and the host is localhost, and we'll test that connection. Connected, okay. So when we connect to that, then this this first uh, has. We'll come back to that as soon as we. It's still running. All right. Let's see, fifteen. So this is one of the doc IDs of the um, Word database, or of the, of the Word file. So this shows that the content from the Word file was loaded into the Redis database. All right, we'll let this finish up, and we'll just verify that that document ID came from uh, a Word file. One more Python PDF two text. This is pretty fast. All right, so if we look back in that uh, home, then downloads content one five two is a docx file. So that shows that the Redis database was loaded with the content from the docx file. The last thing to run is the query interface. And again, as with before, you can either choose a predefined question or create a new question. So we'll assume that the previous video was watched and we'll just show that this is still working. So that concludes this video tutorial of our second submission for the qualifying challenge for the Cognitive Computing Challenge. Thank you for your help.